guys, so I'm at Locals Food today, which I'm sure you guys have seen on my feed before if you've been following me for a long time. I love this restaurant, especially for like their sandwiches, which is awesome for lunchtime. But the one thing I didn't know was that they actually have dinner items as well. So here we got the lamb bolognese. I'm pretty sure I pronounced that wrong. And then we got the salmon. And then we have the seafood sandwich, which looks like there's some um, shrimp and crabs inside. Look at those shrimp pieces, that's kind of big. I like it. And then you get to order sides with it, which I got a soup for this one. This is the bun me. Let's see what's inside really quick. Ooh, it actually looks like a real bun me, which is a Vietnamese sandwich. <laughs> And then I asked for the house-made chips, which are amazing. Like the crispiness of it is super good. This is the broccoli quinoa. And then this is my favorite. This is the truffle egg sandwich with the kale and the potato. And then you can bring your dog on this dog friendly patio. I don't know if you guys can see them. This is Kaylin. Kaylin is a chow chow. He is 10 weeks old and he's super excited because he just saw a bird run by. <laughs> All right, and then this is Chloe. Hey, Chloe. She is a multi poo and she is five years old. <laughs> so, even though I've been here so many times, I usually get the truffle egg salad sandwich. And so now I'm gonna try this um, seafood one on a ciabatta sandwich bread. Look at that. Coloring, the shrimp, the crab. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay. Wow, like a hint of lemon, I think. And it smells, or like, it goes so well with that sandwich. Like, it's so good. The shrimp is flavorful, the bread, the lettuce, the onion, like, I don't know, it just goes so well together. Love it. Let me try this. So this is the vegan curry, I think. No, no, vegan chowder, vegan chowder. So, how they make it is, instead of oysters, they use oyster mushroom, and then instead of milk, they use, um, what did I use? Curry milk or something like that? I don't know, something vegan, I forgot. All right, I'm gonna try it. It's like I got some potato and the cracker. Wow, that's really good. Try to find a mushroom. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Love it, love it. It doesn't taste like clam chowder per se, but the consistency is there. It's really good. All right. Oh no, I dropped all the onions. out before it stabs me. Let's try on the meat side over here. Mm. Wow. It looks like the barbecue pork sandwich, but it doesn't taste like the Vietnamese one. Like, I mean, you wouldn't want it to taste like the Vietnamese one anyway. You could just go to a Vietnamese store. But the pork wasn't dry. It looks like a brisket type of pork. Yeah. Like kind of Americanized barbecue, but not really. Okay. Their chips. Don't know if you can hear that, but. Oh, I love their chip. Never tried this before. This is their broccoli quinoa. Huh. 
healthy. I like it. <laughs> All right, then I'll try. Well, not really trying this one because I already know I love it. All right. Mmm, you got egg. Gee. You can really taste the truffle. And I love that. And if y'all know me, you know that I, I love egg. Like, love it. I will eat it on anything. Honestly. Alright. Well, let's try the lamb pasta. This is on their dinner menu. So I like this a lot because the tomato sauce isn't like super sour. It's like a little sweet, a hint of sugar sweetness in it, which is like perfect for me. I usually put sugar in my spaghetti. Love that. Okay. Now we got the, the salmon. Ooh, look at that. Oh no, it broke. Oh, there's a sauce under here. Let me dip that. Sauce. Oh, and I got some yam in here, too. Mm -hmm. Cooked perfectly. Not dry. Look at that. Wow. Let me get some of that sauce in there. Some more of that. Mmm. Okay. That was really good. Mm. I didn't even try this and this yet. This is the kale salad. Healthy and delicious. I love the um, little fruits that they put in there. It gives it like a kick of sweetness. And then we got the red potatoes, which looks freaking amazing. And it is. All right, guys. Oh, this is my pineapple basil daiquiri. They have this during happy hour. Their cocktails are $7, wines are $5, which I didn't even know there was a happy hour here. So, like I said, I've been here many times, so obviously that's a thumbs up for me. So if you guys haven't been here yet and you're feeling a little healthy, but you don't want, like, grass, <laughs> come by try anything on their menu it's super good all right y'all so let me know what you think in the comments below don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos Cheers.